Hi, my name is Dex from My Consult, and since 2003, we've actually been helping business simplify their accounting process. So we actually started this channel to help even more people use their systems more effectively. So if you like what we are doing today, do like and subscribe and support us. Alright, so in today's video, we'll be looking at how we can actually transition from 6% service tax to 8% in SQL accounting. Alright, so the first thing you will need to make sure is you have upgraded your SQL accounting to version 842. So how do you know which version are you on? on Alright, so you can come here, version here, you take the last three digits here, 842. Alright, so if you are not on this current version, you can actually contact our support team for the upgrade. Right. Okay, so once you have done that, all you just need to do is let's say you have a new invoice as of first of March, right? So you press invoice, you press new, we select my customer. Okay, select any customer. So let's say we just take the date as 28 of February first, alright? So we press plus, we select our product or services, we select, and then from here we select here service tax as we service tax. Okay, straight away you can see the rate is 6%, right? And then from here, we can actually now try and see what will happen if my invoice is as of 1st of March. So I put here 1st of March, enter. Straight away, the system will notify you the tax rate has been updated accordingly. Okay, press OK. And then you can see now is 8%, alright? So once you're done, we just press save. Okay. Right, and then when we preview, that preview function tag number two so you can see scroll down you can see that the tax rate will be eight percent okay all right so one of the other questions our client asks what happens if i have a quotation issue in february but the customer only confirms in march okay so how we can do this let's say we create a new quotation new select say uh, alpha and beta Okay, and then we select a product. Here, take this item, and we put here. This is without the text, so we come here. Few chooser, we select here text. Okay, okay. So we select this is a service tax as we. So you will calculate based on six percent, and it's two hundred sixty-five ringgit only. All right. So once you're done, we just press save. Let's say for example, if now the customer confirms it in March, so we come to invoice here, we press new, we select here, select alpha and beta. So we change the date here, maybe you put 3rd of March, right? And when we press here, transfer from quotation, we select the quotation, press OK. Straight away, you can see the tax will be automatically changed to 8% and now you have to pay 270 ringgit. alright? So there's no additional steps you need to go back, change quotation and things like that. You can still use the same quotation, convert into invoice and the rate will automatically change if your invoice is issued after 1st of March, alright? So this is actually how easy it is to transition from 6% to 8% inside SQL accounting. You leave a comment below if you'd like us to cover another topic. Thanks!